Hi guys! Welcome back sa Shannon Land Vlog. Ganito ang nangyayari sa aming bahay guys dahil sa online class. Ayan guys. di ba ang linis? Ganyan pagka ang anak niya ay nag-online class. Yung experiment ay nasa bahay. We should know where the color change to determine to detect. We should know for the color change to determine whether the starch is present or not. So the next one we will put the iodine is the rice. Next is the bread. Now going on to the non-starch solutions, the sugar and the apple. As you can see from the solution, the all-purpose flour, the rice, and the bread all have turned the to blue-black color. As we add iodine to the solution, the blue-black color is seen, which indicates that the starch is present. If starch amylose is not present, then the color will stay orange like this one, that's one. orange or yellow, like the apple and the sugar. A starch amylopectin does not give the color um, so it's the, the orange or yellow. This happens because the iodine bonds with the starch, starch to create a new compound. Chemical change has happened taken place as indicated by the color change. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna do this. I would like to thank my mother for giving me ideas and materials to make this experiment possible. Good day, I'm Faye Marielle Gaping and today we're going to do a starch test to determine the presence of carbohydrates. The materials that we need are all-purpose flour and water, rice, sugar, bread, apple, paper plates, kitchen towel, plastic cups, dropper or syringe, 
and the IUD installation. The first step we need to do is prepare the materi materials and the food samples that we need. So after that, let's go on to the experiment. Put two to three drops of iodine to the solution. The first is the all-purpose jar in water. The next is the rice. The next is the sugar. Then the bread. And then the apple. You need to take note of the color changes in order to determine whether the starch is present or not. As we add iodine to a solution, a blue dot is seen in the all-purpose flour, in the rice, and in the bread. And this indicates that the starch is present. If a starch amylose is not present, the color will stay orange or yellow, just like the sugar and the apple. So this happens because the iodine bonds with the starch to create a new compound. Chemical change has taken place in the, as indicated by the color change. When you're done, you need to wash your hands and throw everything away in the trash bin. I would like to thank my mother for giving me ideas and materials to make this experiment possible.